Hey. All right, we are showered. Showered out the door. We spent most of the day today at the pool. So uh, we decided to go out and possibly visit, uh, which is the Rusty Rocket. And uh, we're gonna catch a bus, which is our normal way of transportation on St. Martin. Yes. It's easy, it's cheap. Uh, we get pretty much anywhere that we wanna go. Tell them where we're going because I'm I have just no rusty rocket, but Alright. Quick ride, geez, that was probably what five minutes maybe? Maybe if that. And we're here at the rusty rocket. Hey folks. Howdy, honey. So we got to the Rusty Rocket. Got the Rocket Punch. It's delicious. She likes it. I so. do. And it's got a nice big floater on top. And I'm wondering if I should mix it all in or just kind of wait for the end and get a nice big hefty shot. Yeah. Pretty good. It's got kind of like a banana flavor to it, right? It's like, a, like some kind of banana. I didn't get the banana. In there. You didn't get that? Huh. Oh. Maybe it's just me. We papaya. Papaya. Okay. Very tropical, not your typical fruit punch. Uh, yeah. Rum punch. That's good because I don't. I can't. I'm sensitive to pineapple, so I have to. He rolls his eyes. Like that. Well, I mean, it's just. It's disappointing because we're in the Caribbean. Everything's pineapple. I know, pineapple, and I right? love pineapple. Love it. Yeah. So the uh, the bus ride over from Maho to. Um, the Rusty Rocket was, what, maybe five minutes? It was really quick. Um, it it's was just really past quick. the airport. Cost us a dollar a piece. Um, that's why we travel the buses around the island. I mean, we can get from Maho to Phillipsburg for three dollars a piece. Yeah. Each way. So. It may take longer than your average ride, taxi ride and whatnot, because they don't take the shortcuts, they go the long way around. But definitely uh, worth it, it's affordable. Uh, just remember to say good morning or good afternoon, because that's appropriate. Yes. When traveling like a local. Uh, this well, is, when in St. Martin, uh, like, do like as the native. locals do, yes. yeah. They're friendly to you, be friendly back. Have fun, there's plenty of fun stuff to do here. And we're gonna show you a lot of it. So you might see my eye tearing over here and, and dropping like a little drop of water. I got suntan lotion in earlier and my eye is burning and it's tearing, which is why I'm wearing my sunglasses so I don't have to subject you to my red swollen eye. But so if you do see it, I'm not actually crying. I'm actually pretty happy and relaxed on vacation. It's just that my eye is burning. We've got some food on order. Uh, I got the Godfather mm. burger. Which is uh, sounded good to me. And you got the Apollo Creed. Apollo Creed, which um, had a fried egg, gouda, and a bacon onion cream. Hmm. Got Mine a bacon. Was uh, sharp cheddar and a healthy dollop of garlic butter. So sounded interesting. <laughs> and we'll be sure to show you that once we get it. But yeah, I think I'm getting down to that floater right now. Delicious. Very, very good. Breeze coming off the water, I'm as you can see. I'm not particularly a fan yeah. of these paper straws because they start to fold on you. Mm. Uh, you know, somebody was talking about long. those candy straws. What was that where we were? It was that probably were another YouTuber. Uh, yeah. Was it? Yeah, I think it was. Uh, <laughs> someone somewhere. Had a candy straw. Oh, I think you're right. I think it was yeah. easier. Had to have been. I haven't found them. We yet. don't get out that much. No, we do not. <laughs> <laughs> We're trying though. We'll be Ooh. in St. Martin for two weeks. Yeah. Got to the floater. 
should have just mixed it in from the beginning. Mine, mine's mixing a little bit, yeah. And you try to stir your drink with this and it just... Well, is yours all... Oh, I can see it. Mine's not like that. What are you doing to your straw? It's those paper. manly masculine hands. You know. It's paper. <laughs> it's going to fall apart almost right away. So. Whew. That was all floater. <clears throat> oh, ow. That'll zing ya. <laughs> this is a, a neat little place. Kind of in the middle of nowhere yeah. as far as like tourists or hospitality related industries are. Yeah, if you didn't know yeah. it was here, it'd be very hard to find it. Yeah, we only found it through uh, one of Roselle's uh, videos. Um, Traveling Island Girl. Yeah. yeah, I think it was called the best burgers on St. Martin or something like that. I uh, figured, okay. We've been most places, and, or a lot of places. Let's check this out. Rusty Rocket is actually owned by uh, Roselle and her husband. I forget her husband's name. But we figured, okay, five minutes from our uh, timeshare, let's go by, have yeah. dinner here. Uh, easy enough to get here, but as you just heard, it's right on the uh, eastern side uh, of uh, the airport runway, so. Right next to Win, Win Air? Yeah, it's right across the street from Win Air, so that was an e easy reference point. Um, if you're coming from Maho, uh, <clears throat> taking a bus, uh, you're gonna go past the terminal, you're gonna go through the roundabout, and then it's gonna, then uh, the road makes a sharp uh, left-hand turn and pretty much right there is, is the Win Air building. Ask the bus to stop, just say stop please. And the bus will pull over, you get out, take a cross road, walk right there, cross over to the Rusty Rocket, and uh, have some good food and good fun. Cheers. food. So we've got curly fries, spicy sauce. Pickle. According to Lori. Yes, spicy. He'll love it. Doesn't taste that spicy though. Well then eat it with a fry. <laughs> Maybe the fries are spicy. Oh, okay. <laughs> a little mini pickle. Mm. Oh, no, Dill I'm pickle. Eat this. this is humongous. All that lipstick in there. That's a pretty big burger. They gave you me know, we have a, sauteed onions because I don't like raw onions. We have a brew pub and this looks like a half pound burger. And we stopped doing half pound single patties because we found that it took forever to cook them. It does. Uh, but so, I just figured we're on island time. Yeah, we're not in a hurry, so who cares? You know, we've been here, what? Not that long, I mean, it's like 20 minutes. Yeah. And they've got our food out to us, so. I finished my first drink and got a second one. <laughs> I'm still Pain on the killer, same one. Which is pretty good. Like it. Yeah, it tastes like ice cream. So, this is the, I think the special rusty rocket sauce. I'm gonna go ahead and put that on my burger. All right. But it may be for the fries, I don't know. They didn't say. I thought it was for the fries. Um, look at the size of this burger. I don't know how I'm gonna eat this, and if I do, it's gonna be very embarrassing. So make sure that you edit as okay, much as Okay, we gotta can. edit. <laughs> yeah. Let's see. Tasty burger. How Juicy. Yours? Yeah. yeah it's, um, I wasn't quite sure what to expect, but. Yeah, it's probably about a medium. Yeah. Yeah. I asked for a medium. I asked for a medium. 
so, so you can see that. So we have moved out to the cabana. Yeah, you can't show me and, it. <laughs> uh, oh my gosh. Ordered some more drinks. We're gonna sit out here and enjoy the view right on the water. It's gorgeous out here. This is uh, classic St. Martin. So you got another rocket punch, is that right? Yes, I did. Oh, and it looks, it looks the same. My, this time, I'm gonna stir it. Yeah, you wanna stir okay. that floater. Because <laughs> when you get to the get bottom the of the glass, uh, yeah. It got a little rough there. It was still very good, but it got a little rough there. Yeah. Stir it on up. <laughs> you get oh. to the bottom and all you've got is that floater. Yeah, now you see why you, the straws break. I mean, if we were back at the room, I've got my stainless steel straw that I bring with my cup, but uh, we don't have that here, so. No, but we do have a really nice view. Yeah, gorgeous view out here. See some of the mountains of St. Martin in the distance out there. On the bus we're in, in the second to last seat on the bus and this person gets on and sits behind us and I had all I can do to not get high from the smell <laughs> <laughs> smelled really good but I was like wow sometimes you do smell a little bit of the green stuff the, the ganja <laughs> uh, are we gonna have to edit all that <laughs> I don't know is that not family friendly? So maybe I'll retell the story and I'll, I'll say it without actually saying it. And um, Yeah, we can always cut this up, so. Right, so that's why I was saying we can do it. Cut. <laughs> Take two. <laughs>